with so many throughout the metro sheltered in place right now, that's also alleviated a lot of traffic on the road. But as a result, some of the drivers that are going around town are speeding and aggressively. Let's bring in Scott Broom to talk about that story. Scott, we're talking about some pretty consistent tickets with people going well over the speed limit. Yeah, the, the interesting thing is we have speed camera data that's tracking all of this and there are speeding violations that are pretty egregious 90 to 99 miles per hour and that category in Montgomery County is way up over 52%. But get this, there are drivers going well over 100 miles per hour and there was one driver or at least one vehicle in Montgomery County uh, that was caught doing this repeatedly and officers have uh, identified the vehicle, talked to the owner of, of the vehicle, and uh, so far they've been able to stop that sort of one vehicle crime wave if you have it. And get this, it wasn't a Lamborghini or a, a Maserati, it was a guy in a Subaru, <laughs> according to police in Montgomery County. But the, the greater point is that there's a lot of speeding just below that, from 70 miles an hour all the way up to 99. These cameras are catching it, and it's proof that it's a, an upward swing because there's so much open pavement, traffic is down. You know, I think one thing that we have to consider in all of this, Scott, is that, you know, we can't kind of take what is a temporary situation as kind of a long term trend. Eventually, traffic will get back to normal. People will be heading back to work. Things will be congested as they normally are. And being able to speed like this will not be the wave of the future. Scott, thank you. And if you have questions about the traffic that you're starting to see in and around your neighborhood, let us know. Send us a text message 202-895-5599.